So, just today, I was accused of not having the balls to put a certain video on my main channel. Um, and it's it's kind of true. It is. Um, and not just for that instance. It's, uh, it's the case that I like to have my cake and eat it too, in that I have 1,400 subscribers that I want to keep, and I also want to make the sort of silly videos and ponage videos that would get a channel flagged down that you would normally make on a channel of less than 100 subscribers because you don't really care. It would be really easy to rebuild. In fact, if you got flagged down for ponage videos on a f channel with less than 100 subscribers, you would probably pop right back up with a new set of 100 subscribers because someone might mirror your video or your video saying that you got flagged down. You know, so not wanting to lose what I've built, I have let the faults in the YouTube flagging and DMCA system kind of check and censor what I like to say on my channel. But lucky for you guys, even though I'm I'm displaying some channel cowardice. Uh, I still like to make little sock accounts and put my videos on these other accounts and all I have to do is link in the description box to show you guys these wonderful things that I can put up on these other channels that I don't really care about because they don't have the subscriber base that I've built on this channel. So, link in the description box to something else unrelated, but I've feel like it's an expression of art that I would like to have on my channel, but sometimes you criticize someone who doesn't really understand freedom of speech, um, and we all know that you can get flagged on YouTube, and it can be a flag that doesn't really apply, or shouldn't apply, or shouldn't legally apply, and yet it will still stick and it will still be a strike on your account and you'll be one step closer to losing everything that you've built. So, link in the description box.